While the Pope usually baptizes infants each year in the Sistine Chapel, arguably the most important place to receive the first sacrament of Christian initiation in Rome is the ancient baptistry at the Basilica of St. John Lateran. Built in the early 5th century, for generations it had been the only baptistry in Rome, and inside there is a half dome of mosaics from about 450 AD, decorating a side chapel. Experts believe they are among the oldest mosaics in Christianity. We're in this very important monument to the sacrament of the baptism, but there's a problem here, a restoration problem. So the patrons of the arts in the Vatican museums have stepped forward once again to restore one of the oldest, if not the oldest, mosaic in Christendom. Water, time, grime, and even past restorers have been a menace to the original work, which Roberto Cassio and his small team of restorers are working to heal. The mosaics, which depict a brilliant blue background covered in leaf spirals, are pockmarked with gaps where the original tiles have been lost. These gaps had been filled in using paint during the last restoration in the 1940s, but Cassio said they are working with a 130-year-old mosaic tile shop in Venice to reproduce the missing glass tiles. Pensiamo di reintegrare nuovamente a mosaico quello che manca utilizzando sia i colori che la tecnica simile all'originale eh, proprio perché eh, diciamo che eh, si dà una lettura migliore l'importanza è che quello che facciamo risulti individuabile eh, questo è, sarà possibile facendo le integrazioni leggermente al di sotto del livello dell'altro mosaico quindi avremo una ricostruzione leggermente più bassa, quindi sarà sempre visibile e riconoscibile tutto ciò che andiamo a integrare. While the restoration of the baptistry is significant for the people of Rome, the team restoring the project hopes that it will also bring new life and new visitors from around the world to the site. The fact that this is still used as a baptistry today, very, very, very important, at least for the Roman people, and of course, we hope to spread this importance uh, throughout the whole world so that everyone can come and reflect not only on the sacrament of baptism, but also the history of our church.